Stop! Phew! You oh. almost touched that stonefish! Uh. <laughs> you know why stonefish are very dangerous? Let knowledge click! The name stonefish comes from its special appearance, which lets it perfectly disguise itself among rocks or coral. Stonefish usually stay still on the sandy sea floor or coral waiting for prey to swim by. When prey comes close, it strikes and swallows it in just 0.015 seconds. Then why aren't we allowed to get close to them, Professor Hoot? Along its dorsal fin are 13 sharp spines filled with venom. Once the spines pierce the skin, the venom spreads through the body, sending pain signals to the brain. The venom affects the nervous system, causing shortness of breath, nausea, and chest pain. That's so scary! What should I do if I step on one? First, doctors will remove any remaining spine stuck in the wound. Then, soak the wound in warm water to ease the pain. And remember, don't wrap the wound too tight, or the venom will spread faster. Do you know how to avoid stonefish, kiddo? Mm. When swimming in unfamiliar seas or places with stonefish wounds, wear rubber shoes and don't touch unknown sea creatures. Be extra careful when going to the beach so you don't run into a stonefish! <laughs> That's all for now. Stay tuned for our next exploration. Do you know why bats sleep this way? Let knowledge click! Why most animals go to sleep at night? Bats come out to find food. And during the day, they sleep instead. Bats usually sleep in groups, huddled together in dark, quiet spots. But why do they have to sleep upside down like that, Professor Hoot? It's because their back legs are quite weak, so they can't land on their feet like birds do. Also, bats can launch into the air from the ground. So sleeping this way lets them fly away instantly. This comes out handy in case of danger. Hanging up high also keeps them safe from other animals. And since they don't need to share perches with birds or other animals, they always have a spot to rest. But how can bats hang on so tightly without falling? Their muscles are designed so that the more oh. they relax, the tighter their claws hold on. <laughs> wow! What are we gonna do with it now? If a bath is in your house, don't touch it. Just open a window and let it fly out safely. I got it! That's it for today! Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episodes. You want some water, too? <laughs> you silly! Fish are already in the water, so they don't need to drink. Some fish do drink water, and some don't. Do you want to find out why? Yeah! <laughs> Let knowledge click! Do fish drink? It depends where they live. Salt water, 
or fresh. <laughs> oh! Yeah! For fish that live in the ocean, the water is super salty. More salty than the fish body. So the water inside the fish try to live and go out through its skin and grills. If the fish didn't do anything, it would dry out. So, ocean fish drink sea water all the time to stay hydrated. But sea water is salty, so the gills and kidneys have to work hard to push the extra saw out. Fresh water fish are the opposite. River and lake water has less salt than their bodies, so water keeps sneaking in through the skin and gills. They don't drink actually. They need to get rid of extra water. Their kidneys are always busy. Now, let's try putting each fish back into the right habitat. Blowfish. <laughs> Catfish. Dad and I once caught one at the lake. Oh. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Clownfish. I know this one. It lives in the sea. Oh, yeah! wow. Well done. <laughs> I believe you learned some facts about fish today. Oh. That's it for today. Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episode. Your cat doesn't like water. Oh. Do you know why most cats are afraid of water? Let knowledge click! Ancient cats lived in a dry places with little water, and they learned to hunt without needing to swim. Just like their ancestor, cats today aren't used to being in water. A cat's fur is super soft and light. When it gets wet, the fur becomes heavy and sticky, making it harder for them to move around. When their paws aren't touching the ground, cats lose control of their movements, which make them scared. When they're bathed, the cat's natural scent disappears. They immediately start licking themselves to restore that familiar smell. So how can I keep my cat clean? <laughs> Brush their fur to remove loose hair and dirt. Gently wipe their fur with a soft towel so your kitty won't get scared. Clean the litter box every day. If your cat is really dirty, ask an adult to help give it a bath. That's it for today. Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episodes. <laughs> it wouldn't grow oh. into a tree, oh. Wufu. You wanna know why? Let knowledge click. A watermelon seed needs soil, water, and sunlight in order to sprout and grow into a plant. On the other hand, the stomach lacks the conditions needed for a seed to sprout. If the watermelon seed doesn't mm. grow, what will happen to it? <laughs> the substances in your stomach will help push it out within about three days, along with other food. Watermelon seeds as I want, right? Hmm. 
one or two seeds won't hurt. But swallowing too many could make you choke or even have stomach ache. When you eat watermelon, make sure to spit out the seeds to stay safe, okay? Yes! Huh? That's it for today. Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episode. Ho, 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 ho.